looks at the students working within their own small groups, so maybe some sort of problem based or some peer element of sharing and learning from each other, um, as well as connecting with the lecturer and also it's sort of a two-way but multi-dimensional two-way effort of learning. Um, we talked about keywords such as engagement, to try and facilitate engagement within each of the small groups and that linked a lot with trust within the groups, trust of the students with, within themselves, um, to trust each other to get on with the work, to bring the work back that was necessary. Um, and we've, we also taught that within the element of small working groups, a lot of transferable skills can be developed um, that are not necessarily linked with subject knowledge or specialist knowledge or rules and regulations, but are more transferable skills that are valuable then maybe in the workplace. Um, when somebody's actually gone on and, and is working either on a clinical placement, for example, or it might be once they've actually graduated and gone on to work. Um, we felt trust was very important between lecturer and student, um, but also within the groups, um, and allowing the student to feel safety. If they felt that they needed some support within that group, they felt safe to make mistakes. And I think that links a little bit with what Nessa said earlier on uh, about you saying you, know, you are not this perfect being mm. that knows everything, that has the answers to everything, um, but allowing them to, to talk through things, make mistakes, le reflect, learn from those mistakes, and that helps them to, uh, to develop that learning in a more relaxed atmosphere, I guess. Um, there's some students standing on their heads up there, but that's all right. <laughs> a variety of different expressions. So not everybody is a smiley student. There are students that are perplexed. There are students that maybe do need a little bit more support. And again, uh, different learning styles. Maybe you need to look at how you need to adapt as a lecturer to shift from maybe a delivering information then to some small work groups or some problem solving and bringing it back again.